Hello everybody, Francesco here from Movement Monastery. And today we're going to be going over a sequence called the Four Walls. Basically, it's learning how to move from monkey position into crab position, if you've heard me talk about those before. So, the Four Walls looks like this. If you want to just take a quick look at what I'm doing here. I face each wall as I come around. And that's why it's called the Four Walls. Imagine that. Now the easiest way to think about this is that you're moving opposite limbs, so right hand, left foot, or left hand, right foot, while balancing and supporting yourself with the opposite limbs as well. So starting this out, you're going to want to either be either feet flat and squat or heels up. I have to do heels up. Both my hands are going to be down beneath me here, and I want a fairly close stance Okay, fairly close stance like this. From this position, I am going to pick one side to support myself on for demonstration. I'm going to lift my right hand, which looks like my left because of the reversal here. Lift my right hand and lift my left leg. And both of those are going to switch sides. So I'm going to be my right hand back, my left leg through. And it brings me to this crab position. And then I place my hand down. Then I'll reverse it. Right hand up, left foot up come back to this position. Okay, once again, right hand, left foot, come through to here. And if I want to continue that, left hand, right foot, balance and support to here. Okay, now I'm not doing a ton of movement here. I'm not trying to get into a super extended crab position. I'm just moving through here. And I want this to be fairly symmetrical in movement, meaning that the distance between my hands and my feet stays the same throughout the whole exercise. So if I keep going, lift up my left hand, right, my right foot, I come through to here, opposite right hand, left foot, to here, opposite left hand, right foot, to here. And you notice, if I keep doing that, I end up facing all four walls. My feet are not very far apart. Right here, I'm on the ball of the foot, and then when I get to here, I'm flat foot. Okay, ball of the foot facing down, flat-footed into this position here. Doesn't mean I'll never push forward into here to do something else, but I'm just doing that for this particular pattern. Okay, once again, opposite, come through. Okay, opposite, come through. Opposite, come through. Opposite, come through. This evolves into a lot of other movement patterns that we're gonna go into later on, such as extending into the CC roll position or in the Capoeira position, being able to get down nice and low from there, or I can do extensions and turnarounds like so. Okay, it can turn into a bridging position from here, or if I push forward, I can get into my sissy squat strengthening pattern where I'm pushing my hips really far forward. There's a lot that can come from this, okay? Four walls. Try to get 10 both directions. Let me know how it goes. If you have any questions, let me know. You all have a great day. Talk to you later. Bye.